How good is Romeo Lavia? What Romeo Lavia will bring to Chelsea? And how De Bruyne made Romeo Lavia worth 60 million? Exciting news for all football fans out there. Get ready for a twist in the tale. A new player has entered Stamford Bridge. Imagine this. They said no to Liverpool and chose Chelsea instead. Can you believe it? And that's not all. Chelsea just made a big move by bringing in Romeo Lavia, a young midfielder who's only 19 years old. What's even more incredible, he's signed up to play with Chelsea for seven whole years. Now, here's your chance to join in. What's your reaction to this unexpected transfer? Let us know in the comments. Before we start the video, if you are watching without subscribing to our channel, do hit that red button because we bring daily football content that you cannot miss. Now, let's talk numbers. The bill for Romeo Lavia, the midfield sensation from Southampton, stands at 58 million, and that includes some extra payments that might come into play. But here's where it gets intriguing. Romeo Lavia isn't just any young talent. He's already showcased his skills in the Premier League for a full season. Quite an achievement, isn't it? Hold on to your seats for this tidbit. It seems the legends are playing a role in the present. Eden Hazard's influence played a pivotal part in Romeo Lavia's decision to don the Chelsea jersey. And wait, there's more. Another former Chelsea player added to the mix, making this decision even more compelling. And that player is Kevin De Bruyne. Romeo Lavia's journey to the spotlight is quite the football tale. Imagine this. A young talent catching the eye of none other than Pep Guardiola during a tournament arranged by the amazing Kevin De Bruyne. Now, fast, forward to the present. Romeo Levia's move to Stamford Bridge happened after he had a remarkable season with Southampton. Despite Southampton facing relegation, Levia's midfield prowess shone through brightly. This caught the attention of several big English clubs vying to have him on their team. But here's the twist. Levia's rise might not have happened if it weren't for a tournament called the Keddie Cup, where he was just 15 years old. Kevin De Bruyne, a Manchester City player, played a pivotal role in setting up this event. The result? Guardiola noticed Levia's exceptional skills and brought him to Manchester City. Back when Levia was even younger, he played for Anderlecht in his home country, Belgium. This garnered Guardiola's attention. And despite being only 16, Levia was brought into Manchester City's elite training program, where young talents hone their skills. During the 2021-22 season, Levia even got a chance to play in two matches for Manchester City's main team and trained alongside the big stars. De Bruyne himself praised Levia's talent, mentioning that he trained with them for almost a year. De Bruyne believed Levia had the potential to become a top player in the future. However, with established players like Fernandinho and Rodri, Levia's path to Manchester City's first team was challenging. So he made the bold decision to leave in search of more playing time. About a year ago, he joined Southampton for around Peefstein.5 million. This move turned out to be a game changer, allowing him to shine in 29 Premier League matches last season. Among all teenage players in the top five European football leagues, only four played more minutes than Levia did last season. He clocked a total of 22.30, one minutes on the field. Here's the kicker. Despite being young, his absence was deeply felt. In fact, Southampton only won one league game out of nine when he wasn't playing. Notably, the game where he got injured was the same one he scored in against Chelsea. And get this, he scored the goal from outside the penalty area, becoming the fourth youngest player in Southampton's history to score in the Premier League. Levia's contributions weren't just limited to scoring. He excelled in the number six position, bringing stability to the field even in tough situations. Despite his youthful enthusiasm, he managed to show discipline, receiving nine yellow cards, but avoiding any red cards. But there's more to this story. Levia's skills aren't confined to defensive play. He's an active participant in attacks. In the previous Premier League season, he was the fourth most involved player in Southampton's offensive plays. Only a few players were more active in setting up shots and creating chances that led to shots. When Lavia is on the field, his training at Manchester City becomes evident. His ball control and dribbling skills are top-notch. 
allowing him to maneuver through pressure and advance his team. Keep in mind, Levia won't even reach 20 until January 2024. That's why Chelsea made a substantial investment in him. There's room for improvement, but his potential is sky high. It's all about refining those rough edges, which is a normal part of a young player's growth. The key, regular playing time to keep progressing. As De Bruyne wisely said, the journey ahead hinges on Levia's continual improvement. While his team's recent season wasn't stellar, it's a perfect opportunity for Lavia to grow as a player. Mauricio Pochettino's choice to provide him with opportunities will be critical. Pochettino has a selection of talented midfielders, including Enzo Fernandez and Moises Caicedo. This decision will shape how much Lavia lives up to his promising potential. That's a wrap for today's video. If you're as excited as we are about Lavia's journey at Chelsea, give that thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell for more exciting updates.